Fifth seeded Coleman Egan had to get past Chester area and Platt Geddes to get to Saturday night, while second seeded Warner beat Aberdeen Christian and Falkton area to have a chance for the Class B title. Let's get it started. Haley Larson of Coleman Egan goes up against the double block and gets the point for her Hawks. They're up 4-2 early. Back set now from Ava Nielsen to Kylie Schaap. She puts it away and they pull ahead. Warner up 14-13. Peyton Fisher gets the serve right here and Kyra Markerson finishes it off with the kill. Ava Nilsson drops one by for a surprise visit and Warner is rolling. End of set one, Shop gets the kill. They close it out 25-18 to take a 1-0 lead. Second set now, strong start. Jennifer Amon puts one away. They're up 16-12. Haley Larson of Coleman Egan keeps it in the match here. Gets the kill and they're just two down. But another winner from Shop gives the Monarchs second set, 25-20 in a hard fought set. On to the third set, Coleman Egan's Faith Taggart gets it started for the Hawks, but it would be Warner who would heat up and polish this thing off. Shop with another one down the line. Kyra Markison finishes off a long volley. Warner has a commanding 13-3 lead. One of the few seniors on the court, Peyton Fisher finds a good spot. They extend the lead 15-3. You know everything's going right. Courtney Bjorgard with a great save and Ava Nielsen just helps it over. Match point now, and it's the senior, Jennifer Amon, who puts it away. She leads the team with 14 kills, and Warner wins their first state title since 2018, and their seventh under Coach Carrie Young. It feels amazing. We just had to work really hard together and always just work as a team and not just work being alone. Happiness, so glad to be here. I think our hitters started out really aggressive and our service even passing was really good and so that got us in the system and it was just a great game overall. Uh, it means a lot because we knew coming in here it was so balanced that it could have been anybody's game and the girls just kept telling me, we got this coach, it's in the bag, it's in the bag and I'm like, I'm glad you believe girls. And they said right after, coach we told you it was in the bag and I'm like, I'm glad you believed, they believed in themselves. <laughs>